Hello, I'm Nigel. I'm Anders. And this is our extraordinary beer channel. And would you like to, that's the cheeky extra. We've just done a session on... Craft beers. Yes. Yeah. Which was, uh, uh, yeah, it's left us a little bit. Angry. You angry, me relaxed. I was just angry. Yeah. But uh, we, anyway, we're doing an extra little thing. I want, to, I, want to, I want to finish on a positive. Yeah, we do. We do. But so what have you got? Oh. I've gone. The Colonel. Oh, I love the Colonel. I've had that. I've had that in the pub. It's awesome. The Colonel is a brewery beyond compare. It really is. It's one of those breweries along the Thames, I think. There's a little yeah. mile. Um, it's, yeah. I have, it's from Purity, which is a yeah. local to, I think you've had the Mad Goose before, haven't you? Yes. Midlands Brewery. But they've yeah. got, a, it's a New England IPV, uh, IP, IPV, IPA. The V became, it's Quebec, it's a, that's the yeast. Oh, now you see, I bought a couple of beers today, and one of yeah. them was the Quebec. Yeah, Quebec, yeah. Yeah, I've got another one in the in the fridge, but it's a big can, and it's oh. a lot more strong. And I don't think my body would cope with it at the moment. No, after what we've had. After yeah, but in big bottles. Um, um, this is five point eight percent, so it's still quite pokey. The, the kernel, excuse me, while I put my glasses memory on. glasses on. Are they other glasses now? These are glasses. Glasses. <laughs> and uh, this comes in at, oh, where are you? 5.5. Yeah. I, 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 that is an awesome, awesome beer. I've had that one of the local pubs here, the Nags Head in Malvern. I've had that a number of times in there. What I love about the Colonel is they don't name their beers. They just go, it's from the Colonel. It's a pale ale, and it's made with Amarillo hops. Yeah. As in, that there. Um, yeah. I, I, yeah, it's an awesome brewery. Well, shall we, shall I put beer cow on, do the pour from this side, and then, we'll, and then we'll do the pour from your... Okay, go on then. Yeah. God, experience all that. Let's do that. So good. I know New England Pale Ales are one of your favourite beers. Oh, it's can conditioned. I've got big chunks of yeast floating around in my beer now. Oh, ah, yeah, that looks lovely. Right, okay. Let's crack open the kernel. Oh, that colour looks, oh, he's so yellow. Oh, it's a bit angry. Big head. Big head. Uh, New England Pale Ales, they're meant to look like that. Yeah. That says to me, mango. Spot on. Mm. Ke Kevek is actually yeast. Yeah. So it's a very similar yeah. yeast, apparently. Oh. 
See, I mean, this is the American style of beer. Yeah. And they're, 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 they're bloody good, the Americans. They really are, yeah. This is... This is mango too. You'll see from the light that, again, we've got the same sort of coloured... Yeah. Uh, and it has got mango in there. It is soft. It's sweet. Oh. This... I, 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 you nailed that. It, <clears throat> it's got that that mango. <clears throat> it's just got a tiny bit of sweetness on the back end. Just, mm. just a little bit, just to tease you a little bit more from yeah. everything else that's going on. It's just, oh, I do. I've been drinking. I think we have. I think we have similar beers by the sounds of it. I, I know, but the yeah, but yours is a pale ale. Mine's a New England IPA. I'm very, very, very pleased with this one. After. Yeah, I'm, I'm so pleased. I went to my local bottle shop, which is in Westbourne. Yeah. To take a wines. And what a selection they have. Um, they've got the big craft brewers like Daya, uh, Cloudwater, um, and plenty of others. Just... Uh, a great selection of beers. I, I saw the kernel there and I thought, yeah, that's for me. It's, yeah, I, I when I go to the Nags Head local pub here, if that's on there, I'm, it's stupidly expensive. Is it? Uh, Not surprised. Yeah. I say, is it? Is it? Well, no, no, actually, it's probably about five fifty or six pounds for a pint of that stuff there. But if you live in London, I think, oh, that's cheap. <laughs> But, but for when you live in the Midlands, that's really, really expensive. It is, yes. Uh, but I sod it. I'll just go for it because if I want to, I've got to try it. I can't go there and not try it. Of course. Of course. That's what you do. Yeah. So there we go. That's our review of our beers. They are lovely. I'm happy. My anger is dissipated now. Yeah. My punk IPA disappointment anger. He, he was he was Gone. very cross. Gone. So I won't even talk about that now. No, let's not. No. Yeah. What album is that? I'm just seeing some... Uh, what album is it this week we have behind you? What we have to, behind me here is Crazy from the Heat. Uh, this is David Lee Roth, former Van Halen, and the only thing that would keep me a Van Halen, to be honest with you, um, it was an EP, four songs, Easy Street, Just a Gigolo, a cover of California Girls and Coconut Grove. Oh, I, I... That goes back to the 80s, doesn't it? Yeah, 80s. I feel so old though. Oh yeah, me too. Because I remember coming back from uh, the pub with my mates and going to my mate Simeon across the road from us. And we used to sit and watch like some rock show or something in the evening on a Friday. Oh, I know the one you mean. Yeah, I forget, I forget what it was. And they played that video was always played that uh, it was uh, California Girls or just Gigolo or yeah. Ain't Got Nobody. That, that, all played it was just every week we were watching yeah. there's a, a song on here coconut grove if you were if, if, oh it's just the most beautiful summer song put that on lie back just listen relax it's beautiful it really is oh. david lee roth i think um he was a showman he was <laughs> Entertainer, yeah, and had some of the finest lines. Of, he was up there with Groucho Marx, really? as far as I'm concerned, with lines. Oh, absolutely, yeah. He was such a good performer. Yeah, money can't buy you happiness, but you know what? You can buy a boat and pull it up right alongside it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a great line. Um, Ostensibly true. Yes. Um, Shallow, yeah. some might say, but 
<laughs> yeah. But, yeah, no, he was a fine man. Fine man. So. Oh, that, hey. that, that, sorry, that beer is just awesome. Yeah. Absolutely awesome. I just, just pity it was only a little one, but then I don't think my body could take a big one at this time. After Me neither. This is, um, we've talked, we've said mango-y, and it is. It's super smooth. Um, and it, oh, it, it's refreshing. Hot day in the tropics. I have one of these, thank you very much. Every time. So I can't help but notice there's this little man standing behind you. Kramer. Oh. Cosmo Kramer. Who, who's he? Yeah, Cosmo Kramer. Um, I, I criminally missed by the British. Um, Seinfeld. Never watched it. Which I, no, I never watched I'm it. British, but I've missed it, so yes. Yeah, yeah. It is the biggest sitcom that America ever had. Ever had. It's what it was around at the same time as Friends, and they were vying for yeah. that sort of thing. It's huge, but it came to Britain and was syndicated here. And BBC Two put it out at ten o'clock one day, eleven o'clock the next, midnight nine. Oh, right, so it's and regular you never saw it. Yeah, I went on holiday. And um, caught a couple of episodes, and I thought, this is magnificent. And do you know what? It is. So, who's the You see the main character from it? Seinfeld is the main character in Seinfeld. Right. And then you've got his next door neighbor, Seinfeld, his ex, ex girlfriend, Elaine, yeah. and his best friend, George. Right. So, who's the little guy there then? That's Kramer, next door neighbor. Oh, right, yeah, yeah. Okay. Sorry, yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, yes, no, I, 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 it's all on all four. So, why, how did you come to purchase that little man? <laughs> because I felt the need to. I, I, I genuinely think that um, there are sitcoms that do stand up as being great. I, I can't Seinfeld in that. I can't Frasier in that. Um, just astonishing pieces. And as a character, Cosmo Kramer, Kramer from uh, Seinfeld. Yeah. Kind of made that. I'm going to have to look that up. And... It's all law and awful. Go to it. I, I, I will. I will. I, I shall do that. That's my homework for this week. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I'm going to finish this. Oh. My anger's dissipated. I'm happy. I'm at one with the universe. Unless I was okay. Not. Pardon? In fairness, I was okay, but I feel better for that. I feel much better. Yeah. Um, like, subscribe, comment. From me, bye. And bye from me.